played really well. Uh, you know, made a couple of key defensive plays there early uh, with TJ throwing the runner out the plate, and then we did a really good job executing the tandem uh, at the plate. Again, this, those are things we work on just about every day in practice. It's good to see our guys execute. Uh, Machieski gave us a chance to kind of get in to the part of the game that we could kind of manage it with our bullpen, and we put some really good swings on there in the sixth and seventh innings. Um, proud of our guys. You know, we got to see what we can do tomorrow. Well, and again, West Virginia is really good. I know that they got kind of running, you know, uphill there in the late innings, and, and they were trying to get some young guys some work on the mound. But they're a really good team, and uh, you know, we're going to have to come out and play really well again tomorrow. It's Great. awesome, wasn't it? I mean, what, 15, 1,600 again? I mean, second sellout in a row. Uh, we need people to show up again tomorrow. The weather's supposed to be good. Um, and we need people to show up. Well, our, our mental focus is a lot better now than it's been for the last year or two. I mean, we just, our guys are continuing to mature. We continue to really push them in practice. But, but they have decided that they want to be good. And it started from the first day of fall practice. And we've only played two games. Uh, but our guys, I think, to a man would probably tell you that there is a lot better mental focus now than there has been for a while. And physically, we've gotten better, too. A lot of these guys that have been here as freshmen, and we've got our rear ends kicked there for a couple of years when we were playing a bunch of freshmen and sophomores. Now it's, uh, you know, it's paid dividends here the first couple of games of the season. But it's a long, long haul. You all know that. Uh, West Virginia is going to run out another good arm tomorrow. And we got a lot of really tough games, you know, as we, as we move in forward, you know, with non-conference and, Shoot, Conference USA went 10 and 2 the first day, <laughs> you know. So it's it's not going to get any easier. But our, again, our guys understand what the level of expectation is, and they understand what the level of competition is. Uh, I mean, just the preparations working. Um, you know, Colton made a really good start yesterday. Vogler threw good out of the pin. So did Jonah, and we got another quality start out of Josh today. And uh, you know, the, the whole team's you know matching really well and uh, it, it's it's a good thing to see. Uh, I don't know, I mean, when you wait for a year, I mean, you, you sit in bed and you think, you know, oh man, I want to hit a home run today. But at the end of the day, you just got to take it one pitch at a time and, uh, you know, you play for the guys around you, so. Well, you know, the previous at bat, I would looked pretty bad on some, some breaking pitches, so uh, I finally got myself in a good count. He threw a fastball middle end. I put a good swing on it, and uh, you know it worked out. Uh, we're not we're not done. You know, you know, sweeps are rare in college baseball, and uh, that's that's first thing. You know, priority number one is is to uh, get a sweep over a good team and uh, get us a, a good start in non-conference play.